First, it's the first Monday back to work for hundreds of thousands of furloughed workers after a record long government shutdown. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Wendy Ryan and I'm Jamison Euler. As those workers start to receive their paychecks, we're learning those of you expecting a tax return could have to wait a bit longer to get your money. ABC Action News reporter Wendy Lane joins us live at the IRS where people are relieved they're finally able to get their questions answered again. Wendy. Yeah, that's right. But before this, many people who had questions or needed forms before filing were out of luck until these doors reopened today. Welcome. Many frustrated people like Becky and Jesus Rios had to wait in long lines this morning. Me and my wife, man, has been calling in for weeks now and due to government shutdown, we couldn't even get over, get through the line to talk to anybody on a phone, period. The reason being that even though IRS workers were called to come back to work without pay to prepare for tax season, many of them didn't show up. Tax experts say even though the government is back open, there's likely a backlog of work that will need to be caught up and a new tax code this year that workers are unfamiliar with, which could also slow things down. The experts advise to get your taxes done as soon as possible. So we need to make sure we file electronically, we file immediately electronically so we can try if the three weeks comes and goes and, and there is another shutdown, we can get that refund process within that time frame. They also say you want to make sure that there is no errors because that could also make the processing a lot longer. Live in Tampa, Wendy Lane, ABC Action News.